Hey guys, Y versus the sign here. Sorry about blinding you with this white backdrop. Um, that was the thing. Oh, there it is. That I was gonna show you that just dropped. This baby. So I know, I know. <coughs> Sorry, coming up with a cold. Um, I told you guys in the last video. This thing was hard for me. It still is not. It's not anymore. So I'm just gonna mix it up. Okay, this might be a bit loud. Let's just let's stop here. Okay. So basically, guys, this is a Rubik's cube tutorial. I just mixed it up, just like right off the bat. So what you're gonna start with is a. Let me just do that. Is a white, a white cross. So, what you want to do is you want to find the pieces of the right part of the cross. And see, I got an edge piece right here that lines up with the center and the edge color. So, you keep doing that, and there's just a little algorithm that you do. It's middle, right, or left, or middle again. Well middle inverted I guess and then and then you as you can see I got this white piece right here to match up can't get any corners in there yet unless they're lined up then you can just So, as you can see, I'm getting all of the pieces to get the cross, and I'm just doing the same algorithm over and over and over again. Every day, the African's keeps coming off. There we go. Boy! Okay. So, as you can see, I got the white cross done. We're sorry for the background music. came home from school and there's no one here that's why I'm recording out here so this is my living room uh, so then what you want to do is you line up the corners no nope, that's not it you find a corner that oh well and I found a corner and it's right below where it needs to be so okay so let's do that again so you go right inverted down inverted right down oh my god I forgot to uh, tell you guys about notation. Ha ha. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. Um. Okay. So notation is basically when I tell you right, you turn the right side clockwise. And when I tell you right inverted, you turn the right side counterclockwise. In your perspective, and well, in my perspective of the camera, it's the left side. But it's I'm really turning the right side. So, as you can see, I have the white cross done, and now I'm lining up to get the corners, and no, this is not white, this is yellow. So, let's just keep doing that algorithm. And, as you can see, the corner has lined up in the correct place. So, if we get the blue, white, and red piece, do the same two moves. As you can see, I got those two corners lined up. Now, all we need is two more corners. And those corners are the blue, orange, and white, and the green, orange, or green, red, and white. So, I need to find the blue and orange side. And then find the other corner. Oh! And as you can see, we have solved the whole bottom layer. So what you want to do is you want to flip your white side to the bottom. You can. I'm on green right now, so. Anyways, so anyways, so when you got to take the cube, and you have to do these following moves. Okay, so I just turned it to the orange side. So, see this piece right here. You have to find a piece, an edge piece that has no yellow on it. 
So this is the green and orange, and what you want to do this is going to the left side. You want to do up inverted, okay? See, up inverted, left. Wait, left inverted, up, left, up, front, up inverted, front inverted, and as you can see. The white side is still solved, and I got this piece in the correct spot. So the next part of the of the thing, if we can find a piece that needs to go to the right, um, uh, <coughs> no, that's going to the left. Come on, go to the right, to the right. Okay. So what you want to do is up left or right and then up right inverted up front inverted wait so this so it was hold on Hold on. Oh, wait. This is like the... Okay. So, it's... Up. Hmm, hmm. Hmm. So, you go up inverted. And then you turn the front piece. And then... Okay. So, I just, like, had a brain fart. So, as you can see, I still switched it around. And the white side is still soft. <coughs> so... I'm gonna find the. Yeah, not that one, because that has yellow on it. This one. This one's like. parody. What? Okay, so this is going to the. Yeah, that'll like switch around, so. Cool. Okay, so it's going to the right again. So do those same moves. And. that parody. <laughs> Um, um, let's just do that again. Let's just do that. Okay. Red and green. Oh, oh, it needs to go to the left. Okay. And then the piece flips around. I got it. I got it. Okay, so now it's the yellow and red. Oh, wait, no, not the yellow and red, because that has... Oh, the blue and red. Okay, so that's going to the left. Mm -hmm. Oops. Okay. And the whole... Sorry, I had to sneeze. Um. So, as you can see, now the whole middle layer is solved. So what we're going to do is we're going to do front, right, in, right, up, right inverted, up inverted, front inverted, okay? And as you can see, I got a cross, but the sides are parodied. So what you want to do is up, right, up right inverted up right up up and there you go oh it's parodied it looks like the whole yellow and white are solved but they're not <laughs> it's like a little trick um okay <laughs> yeah forgot you have to do this algorithm just a couple times And then it'll get it right soon. It's still parodied. I don't know. Um. Is it ever gonna get there? No, it didn't. Huh. 
Huh. Oh, wait. It's still... It's still dead. What? Oh, wait. It's literally just... I get it? No, it just keeps... Maybe I... Maybe I still have to do this? But first, when you want to do the front thing, you have to find a reverse L. With edge pieces, so... This is weird. This is so weird. Okay. Oh, that's my mom's phone. Huh. Did I get it? I think I might have. Yay, I did it. Okay, cool. So I got it done. Now we have to get the corners in the correct spot. And okay, so this corner is in the correct spot, but the incorrect orientation, as you can see right here. So I want to do up, right, up, wait, no, up inverted, left inverted, up, right inverted. Up inverted, left. And as you can see, we got these two corners in the correct place, and now we just do right inverted, down inverted, right down, right inverted, down inverted, right down. And we do that for this last corner, and eventually, it will, I promise you. I've done this before. Wait, and there we go. So that is the Rubik's Cube 3x3 tutorial. I hope you guys enjoyed, and see you all next time in the next video. Peace out.